Alex Richard asks, he wants the outfit from My Chemical Romance, a band, and he wants the Killjoy outfit for Heist. Now I'll be doing three of these just because four was too much, just because the outfits are very limited in this game. Let's get ready. So basically what I mean is, GTA does not have many outfits in the game, it is very limited on the clothing in this game. So I had basically made some outfits from the characters from uh, My Chemical Romance or whatever they call Killjoys or something. Try to copy their outfits and also try to put my own things in as well. So first of all guys, we're going to go with the guy with the red jacket which is shown on the thumbnail. So first of all, you want to actually put on the red leather jacket. Now this is the only red leather jacket in the whole thing. And also red up Killjoys only wear leather jackets as well. Now it doesn't really matter what colour they said, it's something like that. So also make sure you put the red leather jacket. Also put a yellow shirt underneath because he does wear like a yellow shirt with like black stripe type things on it. But there was no none of those shirts in this game like that. So I just decided to put the original yellow shirt with the thing it says stank on the uh, chest area. Now I tried using baseball tees but it takes the leather jacket off which is quite annoying. Now we're gonna actually want to head over to the pants section and show you what pants we want to wear. So go to the jeans and put the black fitted pants on for this character, for this Killjoy outfit even. Also go to the shoes, I was going to put some black boots on, I was even going to put military boots on, but you cannot put them on for the skinny jeans, it's just quite annoying. So I just went for the normal sneakers, but the red studded sneakers, just because it makes it a bit more flashy, looks a lot better because it's more colour. One of the pictures I've seen, it was very colourful, and without these shoes, it just didn't look as colourful. I'm going to head over here guys, and I'm going to actually show you the jewellery and the glasses and all that kind of stuff. So actually we're going to actually show you the helmet, because he does wear a helmet, but there is no yellow helmets in this game, like a full faced one. So I'm going to have to put the motocross one in instead, but you don't have to wear this guys, and also the ultra guy. So uh, we're going to show you the, the helmet itself, so I'm going to either put this one on, or the flames, and that's the full face one, and you can't get that, or this one here. So I'm just going to put this one in here, because it's basically the most yellow one there is. And also I'm going to put the aviators underneath, because you have to wear aviators apparently with the outfit. So uh also we want to put some gloves on as well so make sure to put some brown driving gloves because it also said I read up that driving gloves are one of the main things for the outfit as well also put some uh, cop frame or well, smoke cop frames basically the aviators now that is the first outfit it looked really good I think in my opinion it's not finished yet guys when I head over to the hairdressers but I'm going to show you my second outfit and my third outfit so let's switch to the outfits now so to the second outfit, now there was one character I seen who was basically in full black with long hair, he looked quite cool, but this is basically the full black version, but if you did not like this you can just wear the other one or my third one I'm going to show you later, but I think the black one looks quite good, you can either have the black boots or you can stick the black studded ones on, I prefer the studded ones just because it makes it look a bit better, a bit more flashy. Now uh, we want to head over to the leather jackets and also you need to put a leather jacket on, so this is the new leather jacket, the black leather jacket. And also put a black charcoal shirt underneath, or just a charcoal shirt, whatever you call it. So go to the t-shirt section and find the charcoal shirt. Now he also wears a charcoal shirt as well, got a bit of writing on it, but there was none in this game. Like I said, it is very limited. Now we want to put the black fitted jeans on as well, because he does wear like tight skinny jeans. He does have a couple of belts on, but you cannot put belts on. So also we want to head over to the glove section and put some black driving gloves on. Now we also want to put some aviators on as well. He does also wear a space helmet, but you obviously can't get that in this game. Quite cool if you could. Now we want to show you the third character I made, or third outfit. So this is the Killjoy 3. Now this is one of the, I think he was the main character out of all of them. He has red hair, blue clothing. Now we want to show you the faded blue fitted pants. Also we want to show you the leather jacket now. So go to the leather jacket section, the blue leather jacket, I wish it was more blue because his is full, like full blue, but it's the only blue one there is. Now I want to head over here, put on the brown driving gloves because he does wear them. They're a lot browner but this is basically as brown as possible. Put some smoke cut frames on the aviators, just because you need to wear the aviators as well. And also we want to show you the shoes as well, so I'm just going to put the black studded ones on just because it makes them look a lot better because the clothing is very limited and you can't put the military boots because they do wear military boots but they have like lines down them I wish I could get them like stripes looks very very cool now guys we are not finished stay stay for a bit longer to show you the haircuts now the haircuts is probably the best part because it basically makes the outfit look 10 times better now that we are in the hairdressers we will show you the haircut you need for your three outfits 
Now, the first character has blonde hair with a slicked back. Now, there's only about three haircuts, which is actually slicked back in this game. Now, I'm going to be showing you the haircuts. So, the first one is the hipster haircut. Now, make sure to put this in a blonde. I'll show you at the bottom what blonde put. That is very, that's stupidly blonde. So, we're going to head over to the blonde section and I'll choose the blonde, which I think looks very good. Now, let's have a look. So, either 15 or 16, but I'm just going to recommend 15. So, either the hipster haircut or the other haircuts down below, so I can show you them now. So, I'll prefer the hipster one, or you could either go for the uh, the slicks, but that's too slicks, it's just too far back. You can go for the short brush, but I don't like that one either. And also, you could actually go for the uh, high slicks sides. Now, the actual character has no hair on the sides. Well, he does, but it's very dark. I mean, I just prefer the hipster one, because it just looks a lot better. And when I finish with the outfit... You don't have to have the tattoos, it's just because my character has tattoos on anyway. But when you when I put this hair on, the character's outfit just looks 10 times better than what it did at the start. And this is, the first outfit is probably the best one because it's very colourful, looks very, very nice. Now, we will show you the second outfit. So, obviously the AV is going on. This is the whole outfit now, I'm going to show you outside, it looks really, really cool. So I'm going to go and zoom out a bit. So I think this outfit looks really good. Probably wear on a daily basis, it looks it just looks really good. So this is the first outfit. I will be showing you the second and the third outfit for the haircuts. Now the second outfit, this guy does have very long hair, not for, not extremely long, but quite long. Now I think this guy looks quite cool to be honest, even though he wears kind of full black, it looks like he has some kind of red backpack thing on, which you can't get. But we're gonna actually put on the the longest black hair as possible. Well, there's not very great long hair in this game. There's this one. And there's also the Shaggy Kills. I probably recommend the Shaggy Kills because he does have it. He's like a brown black. So the other haircuts are just very terrible. They need to sort the haircuts out in this game because there's not very good ones. So we're going to stick the Shaggy Kills on just like the Sherlock Holmes one I did in my last video. And we will show you where you can either put the brown on or the black. I'm just going to get the black just because it like, matches the whole outfit. And this is what he wears on the picture. So I'm going to put this on. So this looks really, really great with the Aviators. This is probably one of my favourites as well. Well, they're all kind of my favourite. They all look really good. So, uh, that's like, a, if you want the brown, it's up to you. Now, like I usually say, you don't need to have the tattoos. I think one of them does actually wear tattoos, but I'm be basically being inspired by it. I'm trying to create my own at the same time by copying off the main characters off the Killjoy picture. Or the My Chemical Romance or something like that. Now, we want to head over to the second outfit. Now, when we are on Killjoy 3, he is a kind of a blue guy. I think he's the main character out of the 4. But, like I said, I only could do three just because of uh, outfits are very limited. But if you want to make another one, just kind of mix them all together. Sorry about that, guys, but it's just because it is very limited and it's really hard. I was just struggling. So, we want either the surfer dude or, I mean, you could have this, but it just looks horrible. It's probably the worst. It looks like a woman's haircut, I think, because there's very weird haircuts in this game. So, I recommend going for the surfer dude. I mean, you can go for any of these, but there's not really long hair, is it? And there's a ponytail, but he doesn't have a ponytail in the picture. So the surfer dude one is the only one closest to it. He also has red hair. So we're going to go to the red section of the hair spot. And now there is this is basically the reddest as possible. But I'm going to, I don't like it too red. I'll probably get like a bit darker than the reddest. So probably not this one, probably the one behind it. Yeah, that looks really good. So I'll put this one on just so it looks like the guy. So make sure to put, I think it was 21. So now it looks really great as well. So that is all of the characters. If you want to put a character in the comment section, what you want me to like, want me to make of um, any TV show or anything like that, I'll be happy to do it. But like I usually say, it is very limited the outfit, so it won't look exactly like your character you want. But like I said, it's just limited as anything because the character customization, well, not the character customization itself, but the clothing in the game is very, very limited. So it's really hard to actually get it perfect sometimes. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed this Alex Richards and your threat friends if you want to wear this outfit for heist. Also hit that like button down below, comment for more, and also subscribe for the content on my channel. Tons of GTA 5 videos and also Easter egg videos as well. See you next one guys, hope you have a nice day, and see you on the flip side. Bye bye.